Okay, guys, today I'm very excited. I've just finished and published my latest lucid dreaming journal. Now, this is something that I've been working on for a very long time. Um, as those of you who, who know me, obviously know I, I write my dreams down like I assume many of you do uh, in, the, in the attempt to lucid dream. But what I found is that the dream journals out there just weren't good enough, quite frankly. They're just not... Um, they don't really inspire me to lucid dream and they certainly don't encourage you to build up the habits that you need to lucid dream. So what I've done is I've created a completely customized lucid dreaming journal that is exactly the sort of journal that I use and I do use it, I will be using it. So as you can see the cover, and by the way, ignore this not for resale strip, that's just because it's when I order a proof copy of this, uh, you know, for my own records. They put this strip on. Obviously, when you if you do buy this, this strip is not on the book, so ignore that. And I wanted to create something that was really inspiring and made me want to lucid dream. And I feel like this cover is inspiring and sort of magical almost. Uh, and it makes you feel like lucid dreaming is special, which it is. So as you open it, obviously, there's a lot of information at the front here, which I tried to give you guys, which is just going to help you learn how to keep a dream journal properly. And it's going to explain it's going to explain a few things about how to keep a dream journal properly. And then there's the explanation here, which shows you like how to use each page. What I'll show you is this is essentially the double page spread. So this is the uh, what you'll be writing on. So you've got a space here which says draw your dreams and you can obviously draw, draw and annotate your dreams there. And then here you've got specific sections to write the date, the title, the technique you used, whether you were lucid or not, and your wake up time. This is so important, guys. Now, the reason that's so important is because most journals completely miss that. They focus on things like dream signs and like the emotions that you felt during a dream, which yeah, they, they are important, but I don't feel they're essential and helpful for learning how to lucid dream. Now, now don't get me wrong, dream signs are important. It is important to write down and, and highlight your dream signs, but you can just do that. You can highlight your dream signs in the journal and then it's more natural. A lot of these dream journals out there, they have like, instead of just a simple double page spread like that, they have lots of like check boxes and things and like mess and clutter. And I feel like that's gonna put most of people off. Okay, that's just gonna make people think, I don't wanna write all that stuff every single morning, I'm tired. I just wanna write my dreams down and then look back at them later. And that is why this has been built and designed specifically for you to lucid dream. That's why I encourage you to write the technique and your wake up time because it gets you in touch with your sleep cycles. You know roughly when you're waking up so you can time techniques better like the wake back to bed. Um, by writing the technique down that you used, it helps you to see which techniques worked for you and which ones didn't. And then there's obviously the lucid yes or no because it's easy to see when you look back at it when you, whether you were lucid or not. And that is it, guys. This is the ver this is the simplest, most effective lucid dreaming journal I could think of. I've tried to make it as cheap as physically possible. I feel like this is a really good dreaming journal. I, it's certainly the one I'm going to be using now, now that it's finally ready, <laughs> now that I've finally got the, um, the finishing touches put on it. Yeah, and I just, I think it's a really good dream journal for actually lucid dreaming. Um, now, don't get me wrong. There are better dream journals out there for writing dreams down in general, okay? This is not for just writing your dreams down. This is specifically and only designed to help you lucid dream faster and more reliably. That's why I've missed, I've missed out on all of the sort of fancy, uh, the fancy stuff, the dream signs, the, the emotions, the like little checkboxes. I've missed out on all of that because I want this to be so, like solely focused on the things that will get you to become lucid. And they, then those things are, writing your dreams down for one and I feel like you're more likely to do that if there's less clutter focusing on the technique you've used and your wake-up time so that you can time your techniques better and drawing your dreams alongside writing your dreams those things I feel like are the most important things of all I've also included a few nice little touches so I've made sure that in that every few pages there's a beautifully designed tip or piece of advice or lucid dreaming quote uh, which will encourage you and inspire you to continue lucid dreaming. There is also a section at the end which includes various lucid dreaming acronyms and it's like a cheat sheet and it explains you know a few things that you might need to know about lucid dreaming. It's all in here guys, it is all in here and so if you do want to get this lucid dreaming journal you can get it at howtolucid.com forward slash journal 
uh, or you can just go to the link in the description. Don't try and search it on Amazon because at the moment it's just, I've only just launched it, you probably won't be able to find it and you'll, yeah, it's just frustrating. Hopefully one day it will, it will come up on Amazon search when you type in Lucid Dreaming Journal, but at the moment, at the moment just click the link in the description. If you do pick one of these up, it would mean a huge amount to me if you could leave a quick review on Amazon, that would be really, really good. Um, it's quite hard to get reviews on Amazon. Maybe post a picture of yourself holding it like this, do some sort of funny face, post it on social media with the hashtag HowToLucidJournal and I will post some of the funniest ones on in my latest video. As soon as you guys start actually posting the pictures, I'll make a compilation of the funniest ones and I'll tag you and give you a shout out and that sort of stuff. I will also pick one of you if you do that, if you get this journal, and then post a picture on social media with hashtag how to lucid journal. I will pick one of you to win every single one of my lucid dreaming products, all of them, the eBooks, the bootcamp, the superpowers guide, everything. Uh, it's about 70 or $80 worth of stuff and I will give it to you completely free. In a nutshell, I'm really excited about this journal. I think it's really cool. I've put a lot of thought into the design of this and how it's gonna work. And yeah, I know what you're gonna say. It is fairly simple, okay? It is a very condensed, concise journal but I feel like that's what it should be because that's what's gonna actually make you use it. Like I've tried dream journals where they have all those annoying sections like what was the color theme of this dream and how did it make you feel and what three things do you want to dream about tonight if you could, like it, I've tried that. I really have tried that for a few months and it just you just feel like giving up. You just don't feel excited to write your dreams down because it's just so much faff and, and hassle to think about all those things. And the truth is it doesn't help you lucid dream. Um, of course, writing your dreams down does help you lucid dream, but those extra things, those add-ons, you know, the, it's more just to make the dream journal look better. And that's why I, I've completely missed out on all of those. The things that I have included in this journal are the most effective things that I know to help you lucid dream. Now, what I would say is to alongside this, meditate, obviously, do your reality checks every day. I have an app which can help with that called Lucid, How to Lucid, if you type it into the app store. It's only on iPhone at the moment, but it will be coming to Android very soon. Uh, and hopefully that will help you remember to do your reality checks, write your dreams down. So yeah, that is it guys. For now, that is that is the update. Go and check out the Lucid Dreaming Journal. Links are in the description and I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching guys. This video and this channel were supported by my Patreon followers. Please consider giving just a dollar a month to support this channel or just click the links in the description. You'll find links to various Lucid Dreaming products, articles, techniques and tutorials. If you did enjoy this video, please click the notification bell and subscribe and I'll see you next time. Why are you still watching this? You should have clicked one of my related videos by now, right? Or subscribed or gone onto my website or something like that.